On Saturday, April 6th, the Eastern Diocese of the Armenian Church joyously celebrated the 125th anniversary of the establishment of the Eastern Diocese. This gala marked the culmination of a series of events dedicated to honoring this monumental milestone. The event was filled with joy, celebration, and jubilation. The esteemed event was presided over by His Grace, Bishop Mesro Parsamian, the primate of the Eastern Diocese. In his address, Sarpazan thanked the co-chairs and all the committee members for their hard work and selfless efforts organizing all of these events. Mesrop Sarpazan directed everyone's focus to the bright future of our diocese, promising many more celebrations to come. Friends, it has been a blessing to share this evening together as a family. You know, when I choose to assume the office of the primate of this historic diocese, and it was not a decision I made lightly, I was worried that maybe I wasn't ready and that I would disappoint everyone. On the other hand, it resonated with the deepest convictions of my soul. I saw in this role an opportunity a calling to shepherd our community toward realizing a vision that God has embedded in my heart throughout my spiritual journey, Armenia, Europe, and then United States. I'm going to make a confession today. <laughs> so I was one day in my room in Echmiazi, and I was thinking, pondering, like thoughtful, and I heard one of our seniors, Varta, was knocking the door, and he entered. And he asked what was, what's going on with me. I, I told him about my doubts. I said, I don't know if I want to go. And he said something that stayed with me that day. And it stayed with me when I ran to become the primate of this beautiful diocese. He said, Hi, Surp. It doesn't matter the size of the church or the parish. These people, they need to hear the gospel of salvation. These people need you, but most importantly, you need them. In your eyes, I saw the spark of commitment. In your hearts, I felt the warmth of a shared vision. We need each other for this journey of transformation. Tonight, as we celebrate our past, let us also ignite the flame of our future. Together with God's grace, we will write the next chapter in the glorious history of this diocese. We stand on the shoulders of giants, those who have laid the foundation upon which we build today. And as I look to the future, I see you as the giants for those who will come after us to build even higher and to dream even bigger. You are the heart and the soul of our diocese. Thank you. May God bless each and every one of you, and may he bless our journey ahead with grace, peace, and love. Thank you.